Number eight on the top ten of the world's best places to see swarms, Mexico and the West Indies. Here, the swarms are remarkable for their variety and size. Let's go underwater for our first swarm of the deep. In the Bahamas, as autumn approaches, storms disturb the shallow waters. And spiny lobsters don't like that. They set off for deeper, calmer waters on an amazing underwater trek. In orderly lines of up to 60, each lobster touches the one in front, and they walk for several days and nights across the ocean floor. They know exactly where they're going and never take a wrong step. The Bahamas are also the place to meet creatures that are potentially deadly, Caribbean reef sharks. If you stay on their good side, they won't attack. And you can create your own swarm by handing out some food. It's the best way to attract them. Get some great vacation photos and help host a shark's dinner party. But be careful to keep your hands close to your side. But further south in the Caribbean, off the island of Puerto Rico, you can really get immersed in an underwater swarm with no danger at all. Here, the seas turn to fire, all because of a mass of tiny organisms that can light up. They bloom in their billions, and if they're disturbed by anyone wanting an evening dip, the water becomes a magnificent fireworks display. Of all of nature's neons, this is the brightest and the best. But the place that really makes this part of the world number eight in our countdown is Mexico. The Sierra Madre Mountains are the place to see a huge swarm in motion. This single insect is about to join others of its kind in an enormous swarm. Here in the cool forests, monarch butterflies gather in groups of up to 100 million. On especially cool days, they cluster together on trunks of trees to keep warm. These millions of insects are so heavy that the branches often collapse. To escape the freezing temperatures of the north, they have traveled over 2,500 miles from southern Canada and the eastern United States to get here. A monumental journey for such fragile creatures, sometimes flying as much as 80 miles in one day. Many animals make epic journeys. These are the top five. Eels swim 2,000 miles across the Atlantic Ocean. Fur seals, 3,000 miles from Alaska to California. Loggerhead turtles, 6,000 miles across the Pacific. Humpback whales travel even further, 6,200 miles. But it's a bird that beats them all. The Arctic tern flies 12,000 miles from the top of the world to the bottom. 